Okay, so this is a nice little mobile setup here. This is the Techion MP1550 uh, rechargeable battery pack. The neat thing about this is you can replace batteries on the fly, putting alkalines in that you buy fresh from the store. Or if you have rechargeables, you can uh, put them in here and then recharge via the mini USB port. Real handy to have around uh, because it's not like a sealed uh, battery like the lithium ion battery packs that Techion also sells. You can see that it is in fact strong enough to run the Cradle Point CTR350. The neat thing here is they're both pretty close in size and it makes for a pretty compelling little setup. Of course the Sprint uh, 597 is plugged in and I've killed, I showed on another video how to disable the LEDs on that to reduce the drain. Another little trick, turning down the transmit power to the lowest setting uh, via the router software is a good idea as well. So you can see it's running. What I'm going to do is turn it off here. You can see how it goes back. It's off and of course we're in the power mode. The thing is it doesn't really have the amperage to, uh, to boot. So what I found is that what you really need to do is just unplug. And again you see how immediately that goes to the full, full charge. And we'll plug it back in, and it's going to go through the boot routine. There you go right there. Those LEDs are on. Uh, of course, the uh, USB flashes temporarily at the beginning of the boot process, but it's going to come on permanently in just a minute here. And, of course, if you checked via computer, you'd see that that EVDO network is up and running when that, that USB comes on. So posted this as a trick, kind of a nice little setup. Wait for it to come on, and then we'll, yeah, there it is.